Next, I want to show you how to add links into your form. Although it might not be the most common thing that you do with assessment, uh, sometimes I'll give a link to students to a different website or an article for them to read and then come back and I'll assess them on it. How I like to do that is I like to use this text box tool. So in our floating toolbar, right in the middle, that T and T gives you a text box. Always in the title section, I'll give the instructions like read the article linked below. And then right here where it says description, I'll copy and paste a link. So if I go into a new tab in Google, um, and I search for my topic, maybe I want to send my students to this web page. So I'll go ahead and copy this URL up here, go back to my form, and again, I'll paste it in the description. As you might remember from the workshop, if we go up to the top, and preview this the way students will see it, you can now see that that description link is hyperlinked. So when a student clicks into that, it will take them to that website in a new tab. It is important to remember to paste the link in the description rather than the title, because for whatever reason, this is where it will hyperlink if it's in that description section. And that is adding links to your forms.